Hi guys, we're back here with uh, Kent, Greg, and Colleen Kernan. Um, they're all here uh, representing a, a Meals on Wheels program through the Missoula Asian Services. So uh, one of the questions uh, that I was asked to ask you guys is how many meals are delivered here in Missoula? Uh, last year we delivered over 100,000 meals. Wow. To our homebound population. That's a, that's a lot. Of it is, it is. And that's just the Missoula area? Just Missoula County, wow. yeah. Yeah. That's great. Well, what is it mean? What What is Meals on Wheels, particularly? Well, Meals on Wheels is a, a program that we have for our homebound adults here in Missoula County. So whether you are temporarily homebound, let's say you had hip replacement surgery and you're unable to prepare food for yourself or get to the grocery store, then that's when we can come in and help out and get that good nutrition, which also aids in the healing process. Cool. So. And you guys have been with the Meals on Wheels program for some time, right? Yes. yes. Uh, okay, tell me about each of your experiences. Let's start with you, Ken. Oh, well, I started uh, probably a year and a half ago, about the same time Greg did, I think. And uh, I just substitute when Colleen needs somebody, she calls me, and or or uh, that's pretty much it. She texts me too quite a bit. Yeah, I get a lot of texts from her, and uh, I just go in when she needs me. Yep. Yeah, I, I, like Ken said, we started about the same time, about a year and a half ago. And uh, I also am just a substitute driver that Colleen calls when she needs, which is quite Often. regular. Yeah. <laughs> so let's talk about I, call, I was just going to say, I call these guys our, our super subs. I have a handful of super subs where it is on a moment's notice. Their schedules are incredibly flexible and they're both so generous. And that's what we're recruiting for, are the, is that substitute role where uh, a person would start out in an, as, on an as-needed basis, right. and uh, and then eventually, as as routes open up, yeah, then we can plug people into a, a regular position. But it's yeah. super helpful to have super subs like these guys. Yes, and that was uh, one of the things that uh, Kim um, uh, Hutchinson um, she asked me to ask you specific questions about, like how you're looking for specific substitute drivers, not just um, meals on wheels drivers, but you're looking for more substitute drivers. Yep, to fill in on a moment's notice. So we deliver Monday through Friday, and uh, we have 16 routes each day. Approximately 300 meals a day go out. And I try to keep the routes to about 20 clients on each route. Um, but yeah, if a person wanted to be a substitute Meals on Meals driver, that go through the same process to volunteer for any position at Missoula Aging. Uh, you fill out the application, you can find that online at our website www.missoulaagency.org. And we have the website .org. right here as soon as I can get it up on my mouse. <laughs> there we go. There it is. There's a website, missoulaagingservices.org. <laughs> oh, th that was you. Yeah. <laughs> and um, yeah, it's a great website, great resource for people who want to volunteer but also get services from Missoula Asian Services, hence yeah. the namesake. Yeah. So right. um, it, is a, uh, it, it is a great program. And you guys are doing a, do a really great job, and you also do a lot of uh, March for Meals too. Of course, you know you guys always come on. You always come on talk about March for Meals as well. Yes. But um, you always are looking for volunteers um, as much help as you can possibly need for anybody who can drive. Yes. Um, and it has the time to do it because usually uh, you guys do it between the times of like 10 a.m. until you basically deliver all your meals. Yep. So the timeline is 10 till about 1:32. Of course, if you're driving a shorter route, you'd be, be through much sooner than that. Yeah. But uh, one thing that I really want to talk about that I was hoping you guys could talk about too is very naturally a uh, dynamic between our clients and our drivers happens, and it's just wonderful. So not only are we promoting the independence and dignity and health of the people that we're serving, we're also uh, getting that good nutrition in, of course, and when Greg or Kent or any of our other drivers come in and, and bring that food, it, it provides a daily check-in too. So I think that is equally as important as the, as the good nutrition. Absolutely. So you guys, uh, as substitute drivers, you get uh, basically a diversity of routes because there's some people who are um, pretty much strict to a certain route, a fixed route. A, a fixed right. route. <laughs> Thank you. Mm -hmm. And um, you guys just kind of come in and just be like, I just want to help with whatever. Yeah, oh, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can go from Lolo Creek to uh, Clinton and to Rattlesnake Denver. and French way out west of town. Yeah. So yeah. Uh, do them all. Yep. Yeah. And what most people um, 
like are surprised to know is like it's not just the city of Missoula, it's the Missoula County. And yes. Missoula County spans miles. Yeah. And yeah. these two are, you know, walking GPSs on, on their own. They have no trouble. I, I know that I can hand them the manifest and a map and they will get the meals to the folks. I, I got I gotta confess that this gets me a lot of places. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it hasn't been natural for me because I don't know the city that well. You know, I've lived here for all my adult life, but uh, I need that that, yeah. that help occasionally. She gives you maps if you don't have uh, a GPS, but... Uh, yeah, I mean, the, the ever-growing Missoula County and, yeah. and Missoula City. Like, even my dad is a retired uh, postal worker, mm -hmm. and he's like, what is this street? I was like, oh, yeah, it's a, it's a new neighborhood. He's like, really? Already? <laughs> yeah, it's ridiculous. It's and Greg like, here is a retired city uh, worker, and he's the authority. He knows how to get to every place, every street. Not quite. <laughs> I mean, like, I, I, for me, getting places is always like, okay, what business is it next to? And then I just go from there. It's a lot easier for me to know it that way. It's like, oh, it's by the, you know, just. But yeah, well, let's get back to uh, some of the drivers. So what does it take to be a uh, Meals on Wheels driver? It takes uh, a clean driving record, number one the uh, flexibility of schedule. I'm, I, I coordinate all of, the, all of the routes each day and because of our volunteers and their flexibility, it really makes my job a heck of a lot easier because I, I know, okay, so-and-so is available on Tuesdays and if I have somebody call off on a Tuesday, I'll be like, oh, I need to call Greg or I need to call Kent or I need to call whomever. You know, and so I'm looking at the flexibility of a person's schedule quite often and am able to work around it because of the, the generosity of our, of our yeah. volunteers and the generosity of time too. Well, um, if you're looking for uh, drivers or if you're interested in, if you know somebody also, it, it, just because you can't do it doesn't mean you don't know someone who can do it. So right. um, basically where can people find more information? If you just go to our website at missoulaagentservices.org there's, uh, if you go to the nutrition section, there are applications online uh, to get going, to get going to volunteer, and also information about our Meals on Meals program, as well as the multitude of other programs that we have at Missoula Aging. Yep, and you also have a number on here as well if people want to get, in, if people want to call, yeah. and it's uh, right there, 728-7682. Seven, 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 cool. Is there anything else you guys want to say before you want, you we uh, wrap up? Well, I'd like, just like to say that to me it's actually kind of a privilege to be able to do this because not only do you meet wonderful people in the drivers and the, the staff, but the, the clients that we serve are so diverse and it's to me it's very rewarding and I would encourage anybody to sign up and jump on board. Yeah. And it, I'm, it makes me active. I love being active. You know, I had a whole career working in the woods and all of a sudden I retire and uh, I got my feet on the ground, but it, it, it's fun to do. And I, like Greg says, you get out and meet all these people that I didn't know and it's, it feels good. Nice. Well, thanks guys. I uh, re really appreciate you guys stopping by MissoulaAgentServices.org for more information. Um, good luck. And um, you. you guys have Thank meals you. to deliver today as well. Yes, we do. All right. We're out to get the meals now.